apparently I offended the fuck out of somebody because they touched my dog. So we walked past an employee at Home Depot. Uh, Maya is between my leg and an item. The employee is directly behind us. The buggy's in front of us. I have Maya completely squeezed out of the way. The woman trying to talk to Maya. We're ignoring it. I'm telling Maya to leave it. Maya isn't paying this woman any attention. Maya's butt is to this woman. Well, the woman hears me say, oh, her name's Maya. Here, Maya. Hi, Maya. We're just ignoring it. We're just ignoring it. We don't care. What happens next? Well, she decides to just touch my dog. No warning. Just touch my dog. Made my dog jump, dog jump. You know, startled my dog. So when all of a sudden my dog does this and I'm looking and I see her touching my dog's like butt. My dog's not prepared for it. That's a problem. I did not you give you. I'm, it is definitely how you get bit by somebody's dog for sure. Uh, thankfully, my dog is not that dog. She recovered very well. She didn't really care, but it did. It scared her at first. She was not prepared to be pet. Um, and I told the woman, I said, don't pet her without asking. It's very disrespectful. And she goes, oh, wow. Okay. And goes to, like, just walk off with an attitude so offended that I told her she couldn't touch my dog. If you think it's okay to go up to anybody's dog and touch them without permission, especially in a store that says no pets, which I reminded her. Now, granted, my dog wasn't vested, but she still didn't ask permission to pet my dog. And I told her, I said, well, she's a cardiac alert service dog after I told her that it was um, disrespectful to pet my dog without asking. And I was like, I mean, even your store sign says no pets. So, you know, it should kind of be common sense to assume that it's a service animal and that you shouldn't touch it without asking. And uh, she had a whole attitude about it. Now, the petty side of me wanted to go get a manager. Did I? No. And I'm very proud of myself. Me too. I'm very proud of me. Because she, she irritated me. I think the part that irritated me the most was that she got an attitude. It got offended because I told her not to touch my dog after she had already startled my dog. I mean, I know personally, if I was to go up to anybody and I went to pet their dog and it jumped and got startled that way, like, I'd feel like shit for startling their dog. No apologies, just, oh wow. Oh wow. It's disrespectful to pet your dog? Oh wow. Not, I'm sorry, just, oh wow. So, Oh wow.